You know where you are. This is Nollywood Pictures TV. Nothing to them. He wants to kill me. What did he do to you? We are hunters. We were sent by our elders to get human heads to beg our king. Please forgive us. We are very sorry, Dugu Wine. Please forgive us. You come to my land in search of human heads for rituals? Right now, please spare our lives. Let's go back to our land. Do please, not kill us, please. I will spare your lives. Thank you. Go home. Tell your people that my people are special and will not be used for rituals. Thank you. I don't know her, but if not for her, I, I, I would have been dead by now. She, 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 she rescued me from those men that wanted to kill me. You went in search of Udara fruits. What happened? Mama, it's a long story. It's a long story. He was almost killed by some headhunters. You should keep your eyes on him. Thank you so much for this to my son. I am the Jalawine, the queen of the jungle. Take care of your son. He has a great future. between mortal
mortals and immortals. You know the stuff I am made of. I warn you. Tell this to anyone and I will kill you. Don't give me conditions because I am not scared of you. Your instruction aren't for me to obey. You are not worthy to leave. She warned me not to tell anybody about it. Hi. Jilamwai, you are a terror. Dead. those ages very well. Yes, my queen. Greetings, my queen. Greetings. Get me something very chilled. Okay, my queen. Greetings, your highness. Yes, your highness. Is it not obvious to you that the cars are looking very dirty? I wash them later, my queen. Yes, Your Highness. Greetings, Your Highness. Greetings. I'm happy to be in your presence. Your wish is my command. 
And you, go and see if the breakfast is ready. for you to ask me a question. My question goes to you like this. What would you like to be in the future? I want to become a lawyer. God forbid you should inspire to study something more lucrative than law. Law is very lucrative. All right, which profession is more lucrative than law? Tell me. Medicine is more lucrative than law, and that is what I will study. As for me, I don't want to be a lawyer. I want to be a medical doctor. Hmm. Look at you. So you don't know lawyers are smart and brilliant more than doctors. That's a lie. Doctors save lives and are more important. If you're still arguing about that, let's go ask mom. Then let's go. These kids are very intelligent. You can say that again. They will be a blessing to their family. That's true, my dear. Arguing about something, so I want to ask you the question. What were you both arguing about? Doctors and lawyers, which are more important in the society? Ah, uh, both. Both are very important in the society. So why do my princesses argue about this? I told her that I want to become a lawyer so I could defend the undefended and ensure fair justice. But she said doctors are more intelligent and brilliant than lawyers. Mom, I said so because doctors heal the sick and save lives. It's not just a profession for people who are not smart, brilliant and intelligent. More of our life is more important than having fair justices. Okay. Life is lifeless without law or justice. It's all right. Both are very, very, very essential. Okay? Welcome, Your Majesty. Did I assign you to be at the gate today? 
I am sorry, Your Majesty, I can't explain. You dare talk? What I haven't asked you? Let me say! Your Majesty. Give this idiot a knock. Yes, My Majesty. Your Majesty, the Queen asked me to watch those cars. The Queen? Yes, Your Majesty. I give you an order. The Queen says otherwise. You violate my order. Whose words is supreme? It is yours, Your Majesty. What is my word? Your Highness, breakfast is ready. Breakfast is ready. Come on, let's go eat. My lord, you met us well. Please join us for You know how much I hate my instructions and all this being twatted, and yet you violate them. Why are you getting on my nerves? Why? What did I do? What did you do? What did you do? Who asked Kovi to leave his duty post only to go wash cars? You? Since the cars were dirty, and I know you won't be happy to see them that way. So I had to instruct him to do so. I'm sorry. I'm really sorry if it got you upset. Please. Daddy, come and join us. Daddy, the aroma of the food is delicious, and I know you like it. Yes. My lord, please join us for breakfast. You still have the mouth to talk. Join me for what stupid breakfast? How about a son? How about giving me a son? I do not want breakfast, I want a son! Give me a son! The two months to us! Give me a son that will sleep on this throne! Give me a son! Give me a son that will sleep on this throne and join my ancestors! Give me a son! That's my appetite! Give me a son! Mommy, Mommy, it's okay. Mommy, don't cry. Such a nanny, why? I want to make us to cry. My daddy, and you want to go have your breakfast, okay? I'll join you guys later. No, we mm -hmm. want to stay with you. Yes, we want to stay with you. Chima! Happened. I can't remember the last time I discussed with my husband politely as couples. Mm. Just calm down, oh? Calm down. Chidebe is my son. I'll speak to him. Oh? You are the queen mother. If Iwe Chidebebe can hearken to your voice, then whose voice will he listen to? 
I will summon him. Hmm? Summon him before this time tomorrow. Things will turn around. Okay? Thank you, Queen Mother. You're welcome. Please help me tell my grandkids to come and see me. I haven't seen them today. Okay? I will do that. Cheer up. Everything will be fine. Oh. Thank you, Queen Mother. Okay. Who are you and what are you doing here? What are you doing in my palace? I am that special lady with a bleeding heart. I need your help. You have a bleeding heart and you call yourself special. You need my help and you still call yourself special. What are you doing in my palace? How can I help you? I have what you need. Baby boy, you need him in your family. <laughs> thank, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Where are you? Where is my baby? Where are you? Can I have my baby, please? No, you can't. You, you told me I did. You gave it to me. Please, let, let, me, let me have him, please. Please. Not anymore. I changed my mind. Please do not change your mind. Please. Please give it to me, please. Please. I beg of you. Give me my boy, please. Give him to me, please. I beg of you. Let me have it, please. Any day you have this baby, you will die. Do you want to die? I do not want to die, but. Let me have my boy, please. please. Give him to me, please. Please. No! 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 My king, what is it? Oh, are you okay? The dreams again? it about? Don't take your hands off me. What was what about? Do you now interpret dreams? Give me a son you refuse. Now you talk about dreams. Probably you're the cause of my dream. What are you doing here? You? Go back to your room. You know, you know, go. Get, get up. Go, go. Move it. Move it. Move it. Son. A son! I'm not asking more! Just give me a son! Move it! Out!
Greetings, greetings your, your Majesty. Majesty. You will greet it. Greetings, greetings Your Majesty. Your Majesty. My word! May I allow your majesty. You know my words. Oh law. You violate them. Why do you always want to see the best in me? God forbid! Just take five of this. Push! Put them under the sun. Let them face the sky. Remember to play the To know whose house, let him know that I need to speak with him right now. Amatan. Your Majesty. Go back to the gate. COVID! Yes, Your Majesty. COVID! Keep an eye on the palace. to Onowu's house. Oh! <laughs> he calls me old woman. That means you find me attractive. <laughs> you are blind. You keep searching for a black goat. Well, search during the day because in the night you will not find it because it will be too dark. You're a blind man. Get out of here. It's you that is blind. Huh? Even your darkness has made you blind. <laughs> Day, night, blind, or whatever. Are they the same? I ask you, are they the same? <laughs> I, I, I see you all in the spirits. Debesio <laughs> Fugapia. Ugly human beings. Come and take some of my holy water. Ay! Ay! Queen Mother, you haven't told me what drink you want me to get for you. Hmm. I need something light, preferably a beverage drink we do. Alright, Queen Mother. Get it and hurry up to the kitchen and see if the food is ready, okay? All right, Queen Mother. What is that? Mother. Yes. Mother, I have tried. I have tried to pretend, but nothing, nothing has changed. 
What is it this time around? Mother, I noticed my husband couldn't sleep. Last night I overheard him shouting and I went to his room to know what the problem was and then he, he sent me out of the room. Mother, my husband doesn't communicate with me. I have complained to you severally and, and you promised you would do something but yet. Mother, I am tired. I am tired of everything. I, I don't know. Is there something you're not telling me about my husband? Please. Calm down, my daughter. Calm down. I am confused, so. I don't know what is wrong with my son, the king. Like I promised, I'm going to talk to him. And I assure you this time, things will surely change. Okay? Okay? Girls, from my observation, Digwe doesn't look happy. And she'll be back with you. How did you know? It seems you are the only maiden in this palace. Now I have not noticed that Digwe is not a happy man. I have not noticed though. Maybe it's because of my regular duty post in the kitchen. But Come to think of it, what could make Diego look so unhappy? He's wealthy and he can buy whatever his heart desires. I suspect that is the inability of the queen to give him a male child. That should be the reason for his unstable mood this period. That's not true. He's the king. He can marry as many wives if he so desires a male child. <laughs> See, let's not talk what we don't know. You have seen everything I have been telling you. Yes. But why me? Why don't you show this to someone else? I don't need them. Shh. It is not your decision to make. Like I told you before. Tell anyone about this. And you will die. 